for a church already under fire over abusive priests. This latest report makes yet more unpleasant reading. 700 damning pages of an investigation exposing sickening child sex abuse in the Dublin Archdiocese. It's being publicly released, although some details will be censored in order not to prejudice ongoing or potential criminal cases. So sensitive that the Justice Minister Dermot Ahern briefed Irish leader Brian Cowan before it could be signed off. Up to 450 people have made abuse allegations against former priests in the diocese since 1940. The Catholic Church in Ireland rocked by scandal after scandal, three devastating inquiries in four years. Earlier this year, the Ryan Report laid bare the physically and psychologically abusive regimes operated by religious orders in church and state-run institutions. This time, four archbishops are named and shamed over their mishandling of hundreds of allegations, including not reporting crimes to the Irish police. Senior clerics choosing to protect the church and the abusers rather than the defenceless children placed in their care. Pedophile priests shunted from parish to parish rather than dealing with the problem. But it's not a scandal unique to Ireland. The Pope has already been on an international firefighting mission. The head of the Catholic Church has been travelling the globe, apologising for abuse of priests and the ensuing cover-up in countries including Australia, Canada and the US.